the quest. Why we make art is the quest of, in the doing it, is hopefully you find out why you do it, you know? And um, I think in this time that we're living, in, you know, May 5th, May 6th, 2011, today, you know, you watch the news, you watch where we are as people, you know, and you know, there's so many, many, many ideas, so many propaganda, so many things that, you know, it's out there. And one thing that is truth is art. You know, that you can't, you can't fake it. You cannot deconstruct it. You cannot have any propaganda against it. You just give it to the people and you just let them have it. You know, and I think, you know, art is, art is one thing that will never die. And you are blessed if you're able to recognize that you have this vision and you're able to go after it. Because it is a long journey, it's, it's hard, it's, you know, I'm sure you know. And um, I think, I think that, you know, hopefully, while, you know, while you're doing your art, you just, you really begin to find out why and and again wh what you represent as the artist and because I think more and more is becoming more about the artist because it's about you and your connection to what you're putting out right so you really have to have this bold understanding of it and you know when we when we're at war people go and see art you know when when we are happier people go and see art when we're looking for ideas, people go and see art. I go and watch other artists to get inspired from. You know, art can make you happy, it can make you cry, it can make you sad, it can depress the shit out of you. It can make you so joyous beyond your imagination and it can turn you on, it can do so many things to you. And it's something that someone has put out, someone, it's like the, the truest gesture of sharing. Really, I mean, I think it's like the most selfish thing to put yourself out there and like, I made this and 